Hello and welcome to YouTube's for you. So we are working on ladder climbing tutorial series, and so far we have set up this functionality that our character enter to the ladder climbing state and perform move up and move down functionality, and when reach at the end position, our character exit from ladder climbing state. So in this tutorial we will fix some issues related to ladder climbing and also we will set up the functionality from ladder to exit down as you guys can see currently I don't have any way to exit down from ladder when I reach at the end position so in this tutorial we will set up this functionality so let's get started guys so here's the problem when we exit from ladder there is a slightly jitter between animations as you guys can see if I play this in slow-mo when I enter the climb animation there is a slightly jitter and also when I exit from climb animation there is also a slightly jitter so for fixing this I'm gonna go to the animation blueprint and over into my animation graph let's set the false blend time to zero when our ladder climbing variable is false the blend time will be zero and now over into my event graph here is the start ladder climb notify that fire when we entered the climbing state and here's the end ladder climb notify that fires when the animation notify ends so instead of setting the start ladder climb false over here I'm gonna disconnect this from here and set it over here when the end ladder climb event is fire and now let's set the functionality So now you guys can see my character is properly climbed without any animation jitter. So now I'm gonna go to the animation blueprint and after setting the start ladder climb to false, I'm gonna set the start ladder climb temp to also false so that we can perform our movement functionality after exiting the ladder climb after this we will set our set movement mode to walking now you guys can see my functionality is properly working fine so now let's set up the functionality for ladder to exit down so for setting the ladder to ex exit down functionality I'm gonna go to the character blueprint and over into my functions I'm gonna create a new function and call this ladder exit down and I'm gonna use a sphere trace by channel the star location will be get actor location and the end location will be our subtract 100 units in Z axis from my actor location this will be my end location the radius will be 5 draw debug type to for duration and if this hits something then I'm gonna create a new output pin of my function
and set the return node over here. So we will call this function before moving down. Here's the functionality when we press S keyboard, we will fire the function ladder climb move down and perform the ladder climb move down functionality. And before this, we will check the ladder exit down functionality. If this is if our output is false, then we can perform the ladder climb functionality. Otherwise, we reach at the ground position. So here you guys can see. When I reach at the last step, the last step, my character didn't move downwards because my trace is hit at the ground. So we have find the condition for ladder to exit down. And now let's set up the functionality for ladder to exit down. So if our trace, ladder exit down trace is hit something then we will connect this pin over here and set the ladder move down to false like so. And now let's check the functionality again. So here you guys can see when I reach at the last step my character stop and also stops performing the animation. and now let's create a new custom event i'm gonna call this ladder exit ladder exit down functionality and after setting the ladder move down to false we will call this function we will call this event ladder exit down functionality and for this now let's set up our animation montage for ladder to exit down here are my animations so here is the required animation that I'm going to use for the ladder to exit down. I'm going to right click and create animation montage. Set this slot over here, ladder climb that we have set up previously. And now I'm gonna go to my character blueprint and when I call this event I'm gonna play this montage and now let's check the functionality so you guys can see when I press the When I reach at the end position, my character properly performed the ladder to exit down animation. And now let's set up the event custom notify. I'm gonna right click, add notify, and end ladder climb notify. So this notify will be fire over here. We will set the climb motor to false, ladder climb to false and set the movement mode to back to walking. So here you guys can see, I can now properly exit downward side from ladder. But there is a sudden 
जिटर बिटवीन वेन ए एग्जिट फ्रॉम लेडर डाउन So for fixing this sudden jitter, I'm gonna go to my character blueprint, and over here I'm gonna call this function ladder exit down, and set up a new output pin. This will be my location. I'm gonna grab the impact point, add 90 units in z axis, and set this to my output pin and after performing the play animation montage i'm gonna grab my capsule component and move component to the location will be this that we have set up over here and the rotation will be our get actor rotation and the time will be 0.6 seconds and i'm gonna set the ease out to true and now let's set the functionality again i'm gonna debug my capsule component And over into my blend out time, I'm gonna set this to zero. And now let's check the functionality again. So now you guys can see there is not any animation jitter, but there is there is a jitter because our capsule component is overlapping the ladder. So now let's set change the capsule radius I'm gonna set this to 30 and now let's check the functionality again so now you guys can see my character is also properly exit from ladder Now we have set up the functionality for ladder to exit up and also we have set up the functionality for ladder to exit down. So there is also some certain jitter we can also fix this by taking the forward vector of our actor rotation multiply the forward vector with some constant like 15 and add this to our vector location and now let's check the functionality again instead of 15 I'm gonna multiply it with minus 15 add 95 So now it is working properly fine. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. You can also support me on Patreon. And in our next tutorial we will set up the functionality for enter to ladder climb state from top. For example when we reach the position over here 
and press any keyboard key then our character should enter the ladder climbing state.